the White House has requested that good Americans report anyone guilty of opposing the developing plans for nationalization of the health care industry. I have sent the following to flag at whitehouse.gov. Comrade Commissar of the New American GPU, as you have commanded, I am writing to report an individual guilty of counter-revolutionary thoughts, expressions, and actions. He has been observed advocating for capitalist solutions in health care, including the privatization of our current public collective spending on medical services and ending intrusive public regulation of that industry. Further, he has charged that the glorious leader's proposal is an evil which uses government force to compel obedience against individual choice and interests. He has also committed the sacrilege of stating that the unlimited ability of the majority through democracy to regulate the life of unwilling individuals is the tyranny which was warned against by Aristotle. As part of his counter-revolutionary propaganda, he has recounted the life and death of Argentina's Dr. René Favolora, who had been an outspoken professional advocate of a universal health care vision consistent with the aims of the glorious leader. In the propagandist recounting, Favolora was a brilliant surgeon who pioneered heart bypass surgery, but was a man with an evil, altruistic morality who bankrupted himself and the state by championing public financing of medicine. This thought criminal then claims that it was the state's delinquency in paying for services rendered that contributed to Favoloro's suicide and the end of the availability to the medical services needed by the public. William Ayres, patron of the glorious leader at his start, discussed with revolutionary comrades of the Weather Underground a solution for dealing with such counter-revolutionaries. He said that re-education camps should be established and that those who failed the program should be executed. Are your public attacks on political opponents who exercise their constitutional rights to speech, press, association, and assembly in the collection of data on counter-revolutionaries, the beginning of implementing that vision of an America rid of capitalists. The counter-revolutionary thought criminal who I am reporting is myself. Best premises, Jim Woods.